come out today to a little place just down the road called Los Nietos and it's got a lot of these sort of uh, seahorse sculptures along um, and that is because in the Marmanor there are apparently a uh, breed or species of seahorse that's particular to this sort of area. Um, I don't know how true that is but it's extraordinarily quiet here isn't it? Oh it is, it's so beautiful. I can see one little place that's occupied and I think oh it'd be lovely to live yeah. here but I guess you'd be maybe so quiet and just the <laughs> how long can you look at this view for? I find it lovely but well there's one seagull look and there's one very happy little white That's, dog as yeah. well. So the, yeah. the view across the Marmanor here and goes right across to the, what well, I suppose that's called the La Manga Strip, as they, as they call it. Um, and then there's the nautical bar over here and the, well, the place where they moor the boats and stuff. It's very, very quiet, apart from the little seagull, a couple of seagulls over there, and the water's very calm. And it's beautifully sunny as well. And as Wendy says, one little very happy, happy little dog. And one occupied little house there with the umbrella. Yeah. And that's all. So this is what you see along the beach. Um, they come and rake it and, and roll it um, every now and again, just to clear all the, the bits of seaweed up. But then you get all these houses along. There's several of these, as I say, these seahorse um, sculptures along. Another, another set down there. We think it's very nice here. Very, very, very quiet. Nobody around. We've driven around the back streets, haven't we? Oh, didn't see anybody. No, and everything's all closed up. And yeah. yes, probably it's teeming in July and August. Yeah, in the summer. In the summer, because it's the winter. Mm. Mm. And although it feels um, like a pretty standard English summer day, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it isn't. It's no. a winter. It's a Spanish winter day. It's the seventh mm. of January, mm. and we're in the depths of cold winter here, as you can see. Blue skies, little breeze. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we do it. Yeah. That's why it's we come. It's called the winter sun, isn't it? It's a winter sun. I mean, it's not mm. long lived because about six o'clock it it'll it drops the temperature drops you know the temperature does drop and it drops massively um it gets very cold I mean, you not, wouldn't want to be outside at night not with a like t-shirt no not with a t-shirt i mean it doesn't freeze or anything and i don't really know no. what the temperature gets to but you notice it's it, down it, to about three does it mm. yeah because we so say we're, we're nice and warm in the sun all day yeah yeah about yeah. well i think it's 15 degrees today yeah it is 15 degrees, degrees yeah. a very pleasant it's 15 pleasant, degrees yes. you know it's uh, mm. it is very nice indeed mm. there's a boat i don't know if mm. it's broken that boat or something there just left there yeah there's Looks lots of broken little boats Looks around nice, they get, doesn't it? Well, i don't know they get clattered obvious. by the massive waves that come okay. uh, you know, and all the t while you see, often you see Sivendi, that means for sale, doesn't it? Sivendi. Sivendi, yeah. yeah. And then the other one is for rent, we see a lot of. But so these are just... I guess people just come for two months to these places, yeah. and, which would be lovely for them. Probably they live in Madrid or somewhere and they come here. Yeah. yeah. And they enjoy the water sports, because it's so safe here being a... Like that. Is there anybody out there today? Um, there was one boat I saw, one little oh, boat yes. going yeah. by, but yeah. nothing much else happening. No. So, uh, 
So that's pretty much it. Yeah, is you having another run, eh? You going to play? What are you doing? She sits and watches us making movies. Mm. Usually yeah. she wants to be picked up, but she doesn't today. Yeah, she's, she's happy to sit. Happy to be out and mm. running around or sitting watching. Are you but we've been oh, to the it. Chinese supermarket again. And um, just to finish off this video, Wendy's going to give you a review or a Chinese supermarket shopping haul. Because Wendy's taking up a new hobby, aren't you? I am. I love my new hobbies. So let's have a look at that. Yes. So this is what we got. Because I thought, you know, a bit late on the bandwagon, but I thought I'd do some start to do some a little bit of colouring sometimes so that's that book which I think is quite sweet a bit expensive I thought two euros fifty but never mind I was in the mood then I've got oh I haven't seen this before this is nice Steve picked that up let's have a look oh yeah it's got a, a zip here oh that's it but there and then it's got another one. Oh, there you are. Let's see. Oh, and it says crossfire on it. Crossfire. So there it is. And it's got a little hook there. So that is to put the. Let me find them. Um, that was two euros, I think. This one. Oh, they're triangular. We got some triangular coloured pencils 12 of them 3.5 millimeters excellent coverage and resistant leads I don't know what that is l-e-a-d-s but anyway let's have a look let me just open them and see what they look like oh yeah that's it there they are oh you can room to put your name on them as well if you want to quite nice hope they go in the pencil case shall I just let me just try that to see yes they do <laughs> that's good and let me have a look what else did we get oh the postcard things we got yes um, so those we got a couple of those that's the fault that's the folders 80 cents they were two of those and inside them we're gonna put these because we they're postcard size and then um oh i thought they were might be clear i was going to say you can put one in and then you can probably write on the back of it so you can see it but i don't think that's going to quite work let me just open one up and have a look it looks like it's not clear though doesn't it because that's what i was thinking about writing on the back let me look Oh no, that won't quite work, but never mind, it doesn't matter. Oh, I suppose you could just put, you could, if you've got an indelible pen, you can just write on that, can't you? Or stick a piece of card in there. So it will work. So you get loads of those in a packet. Now let me see. Five of those, yeah. So I'm looking forward to doing that. And they'll only just slip in there like that. We was going to get like a hard fold, but we thought, no, you've got to keep the space down and that. Keep, I mean, you've got to have little things so that you've got room in your cupboards and stuff. So that's that one. What else did we get now? Um, oh, yes. Oh, and we've got these other ones. Some more pencils. They've got more choice. They've got natural pigments. Carioca. Yeah. Let's open those. Oh, well they've all, they have been opened once. That's a bit cheeky, look. They stuck them down with sellotape. Oh, I didn't notice that, but never mind, as long as they're all there. They're called Chinese bazaars on that, and they really are. They're always run by Chinese people, and they're always so nice. Such nice people they are. Bazaar. Bazaar, yeah. Oh, there we are, just... Oh yeah, probably we've lost the little tray on that one. Oh yeah, they're a bit different. Just as nice. So, what are they made of it? They're made in China, I expect. Oh yes, it's got Chinese writing on it. I won't be able to read that. I think they're the same 
aside so I'll put them in there and what else did we get oh yes pencil sharpness two of those I suppose that's different sizes one two oh yes different sizes but one last thing which is to keep your bread in which all the Spanish have I believe it's called a bolsa de pan just a little drawstring bag which will be good you put your French sticks and things in there and keep nice and safe and not stop them drying out and it's a hundred percent algodon so and it's a medium there we are so that's it living the Spanish life well I hope you enjoyed that little shopping haul um, <laughs> and uh, you know we bought bought the little the pencils and the I bought Wendy a little pencil case as well to keep all those colouring pencils in mm. little book and also we're going to take the postcards down and put them in the, the, yes. the little folder and see yeah. how that works yeah. um, and then we write the dates on the back because I'm yeah. worried about I think it's damaging the varnish in the van even though <laughs> we've only used double sided tape so we'll have to there's show no, you that when there's we, no yeah. thinking it has damaged mm, one of the mm, cupboard doors yeah, yeah. well it doesn't damage it yeah. until you try to rip it yeah. off <laughs> unless you're very careful taking it off it yeah. rips mm, it rips mm, the veneer mm, off mm. so we've got to buy a new ca new door really well we'll we'll, well that we'll have to when we've done that we'll show you them all yeah. and then we'll show you what the doors look like well the one door will be damaged yeah. mm. i know it is oh. it's damaged already i know it is but there you are mm. that's that Hope you've enjoyed yeah. this uh, little outing to Los Nietos. Yes. It's a very quiet little mm. place, uh, right next door to Mar de Cristal, mm. where our, one of our favourite bars is mm. the Arena Bar. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, that's it from us today. Yes. Thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed it, give us a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe and yeah. click the ding dong Don't bell icon so that we send you a new we send you a reminder that's what we do we send you a reminder every time we upload a new video thanks very much yep. we'll see you again soon yep. bye bye for now bye everyone